Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2023-24 Panini Prism Basketball Hobby Edition. Six box, half case, pick your team three, brand new release just dropped today. All card chip, a very big thank you to all of these folks for selling out the break straight up. I love it. Love when we sell out a break straight up. The second half is down to four teams left. So let's get in on that. I don't think this was, that text was meant for you, by the way. Yeah, I don't think so. I double checked with Nick. It was not. All right, Ben with Last Spot Mojo with his Kings. Good luck. It's also got the uh, Rockets as well. So some big rookie possibilities there. Fresh case. There it is. Let's pop that on the side over here. I did not. I'm going to work on that tonight. Is Finau too square of a bet? He won last year. I think uh, the court, it's, it's in Mexico, right? It is. They're, I'm pretty sure this course is like super easy. That's what I hear too. All right. So there's this half right here. One, two, three for this half. Four, five, six for this half. And it's three. It's the half that's on the table right now. This will save for number four. I'm going to write four on here so we don't mix these up with anything. What were you going to say, Michael? Uh, I remember maybe last year or the year before, Justin Thomas, it was like a dog leg, part four, and he just sent it over the tree. And just <laughs> just disrespecting the draw. Absolute dart onto the green. Yeah, Fien I saw a press conference with Tony Fina and he was just like, yeah, I love this course. I, I just wail on the driver and the fairways are wide and I just put it anywhere. <laughs> All right, two autographs, 22 uh, prisms, silver prisms. You know, we're, we're looking for the Thompson twins, right? Blue ice, mojo, gold, black gold, black, all sorts of fun stuff. Good luck, everybody. Everybody but one. Are there, there's got to be one of the cards in here, though, right? Yes, there are. It's a, it's a joke. We're looking for everybody except for Wemby. Like, we don't want Wemby. We don't want, yeah. Now we get a base Wemby. Get a couple of those. We start covering the spot already. That's right, yeah. The Thompson twins. Hold me now. Do, do, warm my heart. Stay with me. Let love in start. Let love in start. I had a picture. Something, something. Do you think you think these guys are aware of that song? They have to be, right? Uh, I should. I haven't. I'm gonna work on that. Why? I don't know. I was just saying. There's Colby Jones, Trey Young, Prison Break, and our first auto is Olivier Maxence Prosper. Oh, it's not an autograph. They fooled me. It's just a red parallel for the Mavs. 212 out of 299. The number stamp looks different this year. Interesting. Uh, that's going to go to Andres with Dallas Mavericks. When did you say that? Like earlier when someone else wanted to buy? Yeah, BH wanted to buy him. Okay, I'm just going to tell those guys the same thing. There's a Kaleidoscope LeBron James, Amari Bailey, Rookie Silver. There's a Zion insert. Um, I feel like Keontae George has been playing pretty well. Uh, 
Scared money don't make money, Matt. Hopefully it works out. The Mari Bailey rookie silver goes to Charlotte. That's going to be for Jordan. There's a Sewer Thompson. It's Jalen Clark. And then we've got Jalen Hood Shafino, Pulsar, and Noah Clowney to 25. It's for the Nets. Andreas with the Brooklyn Nets. I love seeing the low numbers for the rookies. Now there's a $100,000 bounty on uh, Wemby Gold. Wow. Not even the one-on-one. $100,000 for the Wemby Gold? That would make the one-on-one probably a million-dollar card. That's wild. Wild. Come on, Wemby Gold. There's a Brandon Miller, base rookie, Joe Ingles, Pulsar, Malik Beasley, Blue Ice to 125. That is a uh, Bucks edition, by the way. Matt is saying that the one-of-one -one black shimmer is listed for $500,000 on eBay. There's a base Scoot Henderson. Obviously, we're looking for silvers. We're looking for color. But that'll go to Portland. That'll be for Jordan. There's a Cam Whitmore for the Rockets. That's going to be for Ben, I believe. John Morant, Red Wave, not numbered. Markel Fultz, uh, True Red, two ninety nine. This this could be. A, I mean, we'll have to see how it all plays out. But this could be a really good draft class. Uh, Markel Fultz will go to Orlando. That's for Brett. Cam Whitmore. That is Ben with the Rockets. It's pretty good too. I feel like he f kind of fell down the draft board for some reason. And there's GG Jackson the second. Sensational signature. That'll be for Memphis. That's gonna go to Chun Wei with the Grizz. Eight out of 25. Yeah, I kind of like the f number two. I feel like if and I'll, I'll, I'll look on the next numbered card, but. There's Jalen Wilson, Red Wave, not numbered. It's also Harrison Barnes, Red Wave. All card ship, of course. I was gonna say the numbers feel like they're they're uh, they're raised a little bit. We got a Dallas autograph coming up. There's Kyrie. There's Stephen Adams. And there's Luka Doncic autograph. No, not autograph. Blue Ice. All right, I gotta remember that. Oh, but if you kind of look at the number, it feels like it's it's actually raised a little bit. In in bossed. What's what's the word for that? But I like the stamp. It's the numbers seem a little bit bigger and a little more defined. Like I feel like, I feel like some years the the stamp looks like it didn't really stamp. You know. All right, that was box one. Here is box two. Studios. Get a little AC going. All right, good luck. Box two. Solid start. This is a fresh case. Second half of the case is right over there. And that has four teams remaining. Uh, still four teams remaining. Cavs, $49.99. Sixers, $69.99. Suns, $39.99. Kings, 
So all the, the, the big monster teams are gone. These are the kind of lower end to mid range teams that are still, still remaining. Finally, I'm gonna get some uh, some NBA action starting tomorrow. So it's a it's a good time of year to kind of get get back into get back into thinking basketball. There's our first Victor Wembanyama base, and that will be for Tristan and the Spurs. He got the Spurs straight up. First of many, I hope Tristan. Maybe some color. There's Keontae Johnson, rookie silver, and Jose Alvarado, 006, out of 2.99 for New Orleans. That will be for Jason. These red waves are also not numbered, so I'll slide by those. But again, all card ship. Jordan Clarkson silver, Hunter Tyson purple, 68 out of 99. That'll be for Denver, that's gonna go to Mark. <laughs> Behind Nikola Vucevic is a Wenbanyama. Wow. In that white prism parallel. There we go. 137 out of 175. Nice. That's the kind of stuff we want to see, Tristan. Derek Lively, let's look for some of him too. Russell Westbrook, Ricky Council, the fourth rookie silver. Fractal Luka Doncic. There's Amen Thompson for the Rockets. He's pretty good. Yeah, that well that that white border right there looks pretty sharp. Amen Thompson going to uh, Ben with the Rockets. And our autograph is Isaiah Wong. For the Pacers, that's going to be for Omar. Keegan Murray Silver and a Keontae Johnson for the Thunder. That's going to be for Ben. OKC having an excellent season this year. Jaime Hawkins, former UCLA guy, looking pretty good this year as well. Tristan with the Miami Heat. If uh, I guess if Chet Holmgren and uh, Wen Banyama, if they didn't exist, Jaime Hawkins would probably be your leader uh, in the Rookie of the Year race. There's Colin Sexton, Pulsar, and Austin Reeves, 97 out of 99, purple for the purple and gold. I like that. That's a color match. Matthew with the Lakers. No, you do not have OKC. Ben with two ends, but Ben with one end does have OKC. And there's Kenyon Martin Jr., Clippers, and an Alperin Sengun. White Prism. For Ben with two ends. 23 out of 175. 
He's having a nice season too. Devin Booker, Prism Break. It looked like that might be numbered, but it's not. Allen Iverson, Red Wave, and Bojan Bogdanovic. 243 out of 299. Yeah, they're really clean, huh? It's a sharp looking parallel. I dig it. All right, four boxes left. Two down, four to go. Good luck. Yeah, Victor Wembanyama. If you're if you're into this sort of thing in terms of betting odds on the NBA rookies, Wembanyama is minus 600 according to DraftKings sportsbooks. Chet Holmgren is a uh, plus 450. So yeah, Victor Wembanyama far and away the favorite. Brandon Miller is plus 20,000. Jaime Hawkins plus 50,000. Scoot Henderson plus 50,000. But those are your those are your top rookies right there. So it looks like Wembenyama's unless you know, God forbid, but unless something injury wise happens to him, looks like he's gonna be your your rookie of the year. Oh. <laughs> Yeah. Jason, 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 Jason's rooting for uh, Chet Holmgren, of course. MVP odds. This this race is a little bit tighter, Jason. That's right. Jason's a Thunder guy. I think Luka might win over. Uh, Nikola Jokic is plus two hundred. Joel Embiid is the favorite, but I'm sure that's not going to last for long. He's well, he's, he's been injured. Yeah. He's oh right, according to, because of the rule. Yeah, that too. Uh, SGA plus three fifty. There's some well, value there. Well, right? If you're gonna have MVP, yeah, should be available? Pro probably play, probably be available for more games. Oh, it's like something smells really good, and it's, it's you were cracking open a little uh, Clementine. Steph Curry, Red Wave, Denny Avija, Pulsar. There's Rui Hachimura, Cameron Thomas, Silver. Derek Lively, nice. And the auto popping, it's Danilo Gallinari. You're a wizard. Andrew with the Washington Wizards. 59 out of 99. Derek Lively, just base here, Dallas. That's gonna be for Andreas. Let's see if we can find some color for this guy too. He's been a nice addition to that Dallas team. There's Maxwell Lewis, blue, 163 out of 199. So why is Chet in this Rookie of the Year running? Because he did not play a single game last year. So he still retains his rookie eligibility. If he played a single minute last year, then he would not be a rookie. I remember one year when Julius Randle was with the Lakers. Lakers drafted him. His first start in like the first quarter, he did his knee. He was out for the season, lost his rookie eligibility right then and there in terms of like awards and stuff. Dylan Brooks to 175. It's a Rockets edition that's going to go to Ben with two ends. There's Asur Thompson, one of the Thompson twins. It's gonna to go to Detroit, just a base version, Jordan. Let's try to find some color. Kobe Brown Hyper, those are not numbered. Nas Reed, Red Wave, not numbered. All card ship, of course. 
Hunter Tyson, Silver, Dwayne Wade, Blue Ice to 125. 79 out of 125. Tristan with Miami. We got Julian Swather, rookie red, and Siakam, 60 out of 99. Purple, still uh, still Raptors edition here. It'll be for Michael in Toronto. Julian will go to Mark and Denver. Anthony Edwards, and we got Kobe White and a redemption. 290. Any guesses on this redemption? For bragging rights? There's another base when Banyama. Jalen Williams and a nice Jaime Hawkes Pulsar. All right, all these uh, base add up, Tristan's, Tristan and the Spurs. Tristan also has the Miami Heat as well. It's a nice addition. No, no guesses. It's going to be Nikola Vucevic. Signature Prisms Blue. Who, Vucevic... Is a bull, I think? Yeah, Chicago Bulls. That's gonna be for Hilmar. With the Bulls. Halfway through this half case break. Second half is right over there. When we started the break, we only had four teams left. Yeah, the blue ices are pretty sharp. Do we still have four teams left? No, still we still still at four. All right, what's uh what's our basketball schedule tomorrow? Is everyone playing tomorrow? Looks like it. Uh, a lot of four o'clock games. Orlando is in Cleveland. The Pistons are in Indiana. The Knicks are in Philadelphia. The Nets are in Toronto. The, TN the early TNT games, this is gonna be a good one. Suns in Dallas. Celtics are in Chicago. The Rockets are in New Orleans. The Clippers are in OKC. That should be a good matchup. Washington, the, the Wizards are in the Mile High City. Denver, the Hornets are buzzing around in Utah. My Lakers are uh, in Northern California. That's the late TNT game. They're, in, they're playing Golden State, they're playing the Warriors. And Wemby is in Sacramento. to have basketball back. So Giannis Silver, Jason Tatum Fractal. And our autograph is Kaysen Wallace, rookie autograph for the Thunder. Ben with one N, OKC.
Ryan Rupert, Pulsar, nice LeBron James. Purple Ice, color match. Lakers, Matthew with my Lakers, 143 out of 149. Very nice. Back here, we got Dyson Daniels. The white parallel, 008 out of 175 for Nolens, New Orleans. Nola, Jason. Derek Whitehead reveals a Julian Strother to 199. It's for Denver, that's going to be for Mark. And here's another base, Brandon Miller. That's going to go to Jordan and the Hornets. I want to see some color for all of the top tier rookies here. There's a Scoot Henderson for Portland. Bilal Koulibaly, Tyler Hero, Blue, 114 out of 199. That's going to be for Tristan and the Heat. And Scoot is going to scoot on over to Jordan and Portland. How much are the Spurs in this? A lot, almost $2,000. Here's a Cam Whitmore. Uh, yeah, Jason did the first couple halves. I don't know if there's a Prismania. Behind Hakeem is Kawhi Leonard, four, three out of 49. Nice orange there for the clip show. That's gonna be for Anthony. Yeah, I, I'm thinking that, yeah, the, the white parallel of Wembenyama should put a dent in that price point for the Spurs. If it grades out nicely, even better. There's Brandon Ingram, orange, 14 out of 49. And then um, there we had some base Wembenyamas too. The, those will also help. Grady Dick, luck of the lottery, silver, and this guy's actually been playing pretty decently, if I'm not mistaken. Brandon Podzemski. That's to 175. That's going to go to Jordan and the Warriors. 172 out of 175. I like, I like looking this up. Let's go to the Warriors. Let's go to their depth chart. Yeah, last 10 games leading into the All-Star break, he was averaging about 30 minutes a night, 33 minutes a night, uh, 12 and a half points a game, seven rebounds, six assists, half a block and a steal per game. That's not bad. So he's been getting a lot of minutes too. That could only help him just get better and better. Brandon Ingram Orange, of course, will go to the Pels. That'll be for Jason. All right, two more to go. That's what's great about collecting basketball. Yeah, Jordan likes it. What's great about collecting basketball is that it's such a, uh, there's so many global collectors here that even like, you know, let's con we'd probably consider Brandon a sort of second tier rookie, right? But even those second tier rookies could really sell well on the secondary market. Um, just because it's such a, there's collectors in Asia, Australia, Europe. Basketball truly a global sport, much more than any of our other major sports here in America, right? American football is uniquely American. 
baseball is pretty. Eh, baseball's got some worldwide stuff, but I think basketball has like that nice blend of there's only so many, you know, there's only two rounds of the draft. Small rosters, only 15, max 15 man rosters on each NBA team. A global sport. Uh, he is not, I have not seen him yet. Okay, cool. Good enough, good enough. I, I know. Perfect. Stephen K, by the way, if you're out there, our customer service team is, is looking for you if you want to check your email. All right. Good luck, everybody. There's a Scoot Henderson, Cam Whitmore, Cameron Johnson, Red Wave. Jason Kidd Silver in his old Nets uniform. We got AJ Griffin and some Orlando Magic. Joe Ingles. Jingle, 60 out of 99. Brett with Orlando. There's your dunk contest winner. Paul George, and we got Omari Moore, Milwaukee Bucks autographs. Yeah, Clay got benched for him, right? Matt, I, uh, I feel like you are lagging behind the current point of the stream just by a little bit. Double check to make sure you're watching live. This goes for, this is a good reminder for everybody, actually. Uh, Matt Johnson with the Bucks. But if you're watching on your on an app, make sure just maybe a refresh would do it if you're on if you're watching on a web browser, um, just make sure that little red dot is not grayed out. Just so you're at the current point in the stream. There's Derek White to 199. That's going to go to the Celtics. It'll be for Matt J. Scoot, Herbert Jones, Blue Ice to 125. But yeah, I think I think. Warriors going with a hot hand. The Brandon, he's getting those, he's getting Clay Thompson minutes. We'll do a we'll do a standings, NBA standings uh, check when I'm ripping the next box. Here is DeAndre Ayton to 125, Blue Ice, Portland edition. Derek Lively, that's a that was a sharp, smart pickup by the uh, by Dallas. Good draft pick, I think. You know, and basketball is all about spacing, right? You know, if they can get, so they need a big man to kind of, with, with a little gravity, can attract some defenders away from uh, Luca and Kyrie. Good balance there. Gordon Hayward, Purple Ice to 149. Where did he, he just got traded, right? Where did, where did he end up? He's still working his way back from injury. Did he go to Dallas, actually? There's a Sewer Thompson for Detroit, Bradley Beal Silver. Uh, Jordan with Detroit. Thunder, that's what it was. Thank you, Daniel. Which I guess, if he ends up being healthy, I wouldn't mind that sort of veteran presence on a young Thunder team. And, um, you know, maybe some scoring off the bench. PJ Washington, that's right, went to Dallas. Nine out of 75, there's Jalen Williams, speaking of the Thunder. That's gonna be for Ben, Ben S. Oh, you're a Hornets fan. Man, I, 
I feel like LaMelo just can't, I feel like if he was healthy, I mean, he, could be, he could really get, he could really get some traction, get things going. What are the Hornets gonna do? Rebuild? Rebuild again, I suppose. It's not for a lack of trying, you know, they got Terry Rozier, they got Gordon Hayward, it looked good on paper. But as a Hornet fan, you're very happy to see Gordon Hayward go. I don't think he ever should have left. <laughs> Logan's a jazz fan, he's sad all the time. I feel like he never should have left the, the jazz, right? Is it with the jazz? Nuggets? So a little uh, standings check here. In the East, Celtics up top. Logan, Logan thinks Celtics are in the finals for sure. They're six games ahead of Cleveland. Uh, then it's the Bucks, Knicks, Sixers, Pacers in the first in the first six. Uh, Heat, Magic, Bulls, Hawks are in the, your play-in spots, and the Nets are a couple games out of a play-in spot, so they're trying to battle their way in, possibly. New coach, I think. I think they fired their their head coach. Right. Yeah, that's right. I left the Jazz to get a huge payday. Snaps his ankle in Boston and has him in the same sense, yeah. In the West, the Timberwolves only a game, this is a lot tighter race here, game and a half ahead of the Thunder. They're right behind him. Then the Clippers only two games back of the, the, the Timberwolves. And then the Nuggets are only three games back from the Timberwolves. And then, it, then a few more games behind them, Suns and Pelicans. That's your uh, top six in the West. Timberwolves, Thunder, Clippers, Nuggets, Suns, Pelicans. And then your play-in teams are Mavs, Kings, Lakers, Warriors. And a couple games on the outside looking in would be the Jazz, 13 and a half back, Rockets, 14 and a half back. All right, final box, good luck. No, nothing too crazy in that last box, but I hope we can. I hope we're gonna finish strong here. There's Jaime Hawkes for Tristan and the Heat. There's a Jaime Hawkes red wave, nice. And Moses Moody, 32 out of 299 red for the Warriors for Jordan. Yeah, Spurs have double-digit wins, and that team could get get real good in a hurry, though. Warriors are one of the hottest teams going into the uh, All-Star break. They, they were they were eight wins in their last ten going into the All-Star break. Lakers are on a three-game winning streak going into the All-Star break, so they're looking to hopefully pick up where they left off. Minnesota Timberwolves had run, won four in a row. Celtics has been winning six in a row, so those are some of your hot teams. Cavs are nine and one in their last ten going into the All-Star break. All right, there's Steph, there's DeMar DeRozan, and there's Carmelo Anthony, White Prism, 94 out of 175. There's a LeBron Fractal. There's Amen Thompson, Harrison Barnes, and a Jalen Slauson, 42 out of 49 for Ben and the Kings. Amen Thompson will go to Ben and the Rockets. Yeah, I was just going to say that that caught my eye too. I was like, the Hornets were on a three-game winning streak since trading away. Sometimes it's the, the, the trade the trade bump. You know, you hungry young guys, hungry players on that team who didn't get traded, who are happy they didn't get maybe happy they didn't get traded. Nice luck of the lottery, Victor Wenbanyama.
Tristan and the Spurs. Is he the new face of the league? I mean, in a post, like, post LeBron, post Steph Curry world, who's the face of the league? Hate him, Matt saying. You know, I was listening on my way in. I was listening to uh, sports talk radio. Ramona Shelburne, who does a lot of work with uh, NBA work, there's Ayo Desunmu for the Bulls. That's going to be for Hilmar, and that's what she was saying. She was saying Jason Tatum is going to be like that face of the league. If he gets to the finals this year, if he knocks out a championship this year, that, that would certainly go a long way in establishing that. 65 out of 199, Nas Reed. Timberwolves, that'll be for Jason. Yeah, Daniel agrees. Tatum. I mean, it's kind of weird, right? How do, how do you become the face of the league? You kind of have to, you got to have a bit of a personality. It can't be boring, obviously. You got to perform well. Maybe be on a big sort of legacy franchise type team. Boston, of course, is that. There's Jalen Williams, 156 out of 199. That's the uh, Santa Clara Jalen Williams, right? Better, better than Jalen with a Y Williams, who's from Arkansas. I think, but they're both pretty good. Uh, that will be for uh, Ben and OKC. There's Jason Tatum. We're talking about him right there. I mean, the face of the league currently, I mean, Steph Curry, you know, LeBron James, guys like, guys like that. They're not getting any younger. Here's Rudy Gobert to 175. And that, my friends, is that. Brandon Miller will go to Jordan. Charlotte, Rudy Gobert will go to Minnesota. Yeah, Anthony Edwards, that, that could be the Ant-Man. Could be the face of the league. Pretty dynamic player. Well, were there, yeah, it was the Desunmu was the autograph. I guess there was only one. I guess we're kind of getting short. It's supposed to be two. So we got some Wembys and that white prism Wemby is really nice. 137 out of 175. So there were one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight autographs. We should have like 12. It says two autos per box, but it also says on average. So I think that's kind of how they, how they get you there. But still some solid stuff. Second half in the store, ladies and gentlemen. Let's get after it, jazbeescasebreaks.com. I'm Joe. I'll see you next time for the next basketball break. Bye-bye.